I am back in Illinois. Um, not home yet. I decided to stop first um, at Bargain in a Box. Hope y'all can see that. But I needed to get some laundry detergent. Um, what else? Oh, some color for my hair. Black, because y'all see the white coming back, the snow. But anyway, yeah, I probably won't get that from here. Because um, I'm not going to use it no time soon. But... I definitely need to get some dishwashing, I mean, not dishwashing liquid, but laundry detergent and some um, fabric softener. Yep, and then um, I will stop and get maybe a box of uh, donuts from Dunkin' Donuts and then head home. So I guess I'll take you guys with me into Bargain in a Box. God, I just broke my nail. Just picking up. Oh, the heck, I broke my nail.
Okay. Nice color. Plant of a flower in it. A fake flower at that. I can't see doing that at all. This one by itself is three, right? One by itself is three. I can see that one, this, these three. Three dollars. So three. And then put flowers in there from the dollar store that cost a dollar. So that's four dollars. That's a pound. That's a quote. This, this plus some flowers from the dollar store. You can make three of these and bigger. That's crazy. Hmm. I got nice stuff, but you know, some of the, the stuff, the prices are crazy. Hey guys, so I'm out of bargain in a box. I spent $30. Now I'm going to go and get gas and then going home. I'm gonna get some gas and uh, like I said, maybe some donuts for breakfast um, and coffee and I'm going home. I'm tired. <laughs> I am tired, you guys. Like I've been up since this morning, since early been up most of the night you know because it was stormy it was raining it was lightning it was all of that last night in Wisconsin so honestly that had me up I nodded off a couple of times and then the wind kept blowing the door open because I couldn't shut it and finally I was able I shut it but I couldn't lock it <laughs> finally I was able to because it was driving me nuts. <laughs> that door kept opening and we had watched this kind of creepy movie. Uh, it wasn't so much like a scary movie or horror, but just creepy, honestly. It was called Hangman. I don't know if you guys seen it before. I had never seen it. Me and counting the kids. And so we watched it and it, it was to me super creepy slash, slash scary because I'm sure it's happened and is happening in real life where <clears throat> you have these sick people and they watch people right and and uh when people leave and they leave their car doors unlocked they get their addresses off their gps or you know off the mail that they leave in their car and <clears throat> they go to the people's homes because they know they're not home at that time because they rambling in their car because they're at the mall or something like in this particular movie the um he had been watching this um husband and wife and they were in the mall and so he went when they went when they got out of their car to go into the actual mall um uh, right now they're in a like garage area so he goes to their car and he gets their information um and so then he goes to the, directly to their home breaks in he takes his shoes off he sleeps in their bed he just messes up their house he eats their food he watches the tv just all kind of stuff right then um when they come home you know they see that their home has been trashed so on and so forth blah 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 um and then he leaves in the closet the bedroom closet he hangs a um you know a fake like a mannequin the top part of the mannequin he hangs it you know in the closet like you know like he just hung a person it's a it's a mannequin or whatever he freaking hangs it and i'm like it's freaking freaking crazy because in the movie when somebody breaks in your house and you go through they didn't even really go through their house when the police came they didn't make the police go through and search like he did like a quick search he goes in the room and he can see that his um attic door in the closet was open 
and and you know the thing was hanging down but he didn't even go up and check the attic he just looked you know and so the whole time the guy was living in the attic living in the attic and had recorded was recording you know had video cameras everywhere in their home you know it was crazy it was crazy crazy he was standing and watching them at night while they sleep he was getting up and drinking their juice and spitting in it and and just all that i'm like oh my god like it was crazy he was drugging the wife he would drug the wine and when she passed out he'll sleep with her i mean man <laughs> stuff like this happens for real but anyway guys i'm at the gas station now i don't know if y'all can see but i'm about to get some gas so i will talk to you guys later you